hyaluronic acid that's in Dermal Filler and the hyaluronic acid that we create natively is very closely linked to the extent that your body can't actually tell the difference between the stuff we've injected in the Dermal Filler and what was used natively that you're utilising as a store. So if we need to dissolve filler away, the drug is called hyaluronidase and it's an enzyme that breaks down the hyaluronic acid molecules in, and gets rid of the filler. However, because the filler is so closely linked to what we produce, you'll probably lose some, lose some of your own native hyaluronic acid. And if you're at a point in your life where you're, you're no longer replacing those stores by metabolizing new hyaluronic acid, then you need to remain mindful of that, that if you've had a mill of filler in a cheek, say, even if you didn't like it and it's not included and we're going to dissolve it, you would probably need to be looking at maybe two or three to put back some of the volume of your own that will be diminished. So sometimes I'll say to someone, you know, with a complication, I'd rather be softly, softly catchy monkey with it and just do small amounts with it rather than absolutely decimate your own stores of hyaluronic acid because it can be upsetting for them obviously to, if they're here to have something treated that they don't like and they're leaving and it's a little bit worse than it was when they came in, it can be upsetting. So it's not as much from a, a danger point of view that you need to be, obviously you need to remain mindful of the danger aspect of a vascular occlusion if you include the right vessel you can blame someone. Um, so you need to be very, very careful with what you're doing, but you also need to remain mindful of the preparation for the patient. Um, informed consent is not informed consent if you're not informed that that's a risk. So if you're unlucky enough for a vascular occlusion to happen, all being well, you're really only prepping your patient for the disappointment element of it, rather than this could be seriously dangerous to your health.